First, we heard about elevators broken at a downtown high rise. Those have since been fixed and now that's spurring people to speak up about safety concerns at a place in the central West End. Both elevators at the Leonardo and Lindell are out and our Ashley Lincoln is there tonight investigating this. Ashley. Well, Sam, the frustration here from residents is that management is telling them that this elevator won't be fixed until the end of this year. They tell us that since December, they've been having to climb. A lot of times it feels like I'm in prison. That's the reaction from residents living in the Leonardo apartment building on Lindo Boulevard. I'm stuck. I can't go anywhere without assistance or help from two to three people. This resident who wants to remain anonymous reached out after seeing this News 4 story earlier this month about broken elevators at this downtown apartment complex. Very frustrating. And it's scary. It kind of makes it feel like, well, maybe this is some kind of a, a problem. The resident says their single elevator has been broken since December, leaving tenants to climb as many as nine floors. Everyone's really had it. News 4 found the building is owned by this company, Citywide Apartments. Residents say they've been told the elevators wouldn't be fixed until the end of 2021, citing it's hard to make repairs because the building is outdated. This email to tenants notifying them that they can either, one, stay in their apartments and pay reduced rent until repairs are made, two, allow for early lease termination, or three, transfer to one of their other properties. Tenants say those options seemed fair until the company made them sign non-disclosure agreements, prohibiting them from talking publicly about the non-repairs. This resident says while the company is offering a transfer to other properties, rent at those properties are several hundred dollars more than what they're paying. They can't keep elevators fixed at other properties. I understand like things happen, there are malfunctions and stuff like that, but why, why can't anything be done for it for almost a year. I called the citywide company several it's, times and got this. On, is there someone else I can speak to? I'm calling with News 4. We've been transferred before and didn't get in contact with anybody. Um. Sorry, no one is available. News 4 took residents' concerns to the state of Missouri who oversees elevator inspections. The state says they are now looking into this problem. Everybody's pretty fat, like fed up, you know, like what what are we supposed to do? We were also hoping to get information from the property owner on if they were experiencing delays in getting parts for this elevator. We did know that that was an issue with the downtown building. We, of course, were going to stay on top of the story and bring you developments as we get them. Live tonight in Central West End, Ashley Lincoln, News 4.